We come from all over the world to make it in Hollywood. I wanted to make movies, but I had no money, no script, and no stars. All I had was a dream. I was living with four struggling actors also looking for their break. Since I had no other options, I decided to make a movie about my roommates. I wanted to show what happens to people when they come here and what it's like to chase an unrealistic dream. It took more than 10 years. What ended up happening was something no one could predict. voted two things in high school, class clown and best looking. <laughs> two years after this is out, I'll be fucking huge. Guarantee, yeah. I just feel, I just know it, I feel my blood, I, I just feel it. Hands down. What's it done? It's no, no, I just don't see it happening, man, I really don't. Maybe I'm setting myself up big. <laughs> Maybe I'm setting myself up for a big fall, but. Greg was the first to move in the house. He graduated from USC and had been studying acting for years. He came from a wealthy family. On one side was Fawcett Publishing, and on the other, the builders of Mount Rushmore. With me, I would never, there's no end. I, it's, it's my, you know, it's like, do anything else? No. In other words, I will take this to the toilet if I have to. But all I want to do is make, I want to, I want to be in movies. I feel that I can really be a, be a, a big name one day here. A lot of people think there's a lot of competition here, but there's, there's really not. It's really, you know, it's if you, if you know the right people and you have the talent and, and if it's your path. Chad had been acting since childhood. He was a star in his hometown and was determined to be a star in Hollywood. Right after graduating from high school, he moved to Hollywood to pursue his dream. It's something I've always known in my heart. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a one in a million type situation. It's just, I know I'm gonna be great. The first time I met Brad was at this audition for a project I tried to get made. Since I couldn't afford a casting office, I interviewed actors in my car. Okay, go for it. This is Brad Rowe, I'm from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And your film sounds very interesting. Brad worked in the mail room of a talent agency. Someone saw him and said that he should try acting because he had the looks to be the next Brad Pitt. You got pissed off, Brad. Really pissed. He was in sales, politics, and now he was determined to be an actor. Wes slept on the couch in the living room. He was the last to move in the house. Hello, I'm Wes. I'm from Little Rock, Arkansas. Sorry, let me clear that up. Hi, I'm Wes, I'm from Little Rock, Arkansas. After dropping out of Juilliard, he came to Hollywood to pursue a career in film. Two years from now, I see, I see myself being able to make choices in my work and being able to uh, establish myself. And I, I see myself uh, alone. And I see myself working hard in two years. Is that what you want? No, not necessarily uh, the alone part, but I, I do want to work hard. I do want to continue the creativity. 